I know the Cardinals media team has seen it, and I know some people in the building have seen this as well, but we have been starving for change. We've been rocking the same uniform since like 2004. Whatever the year Larry Fitzgerald got drafted is the year we unveiled these jerseys right here. And although the Cardinals haven't announced new jerseys yet, I don't think it'll happen this season, but next year, I got a strong feeling. They did unveil these all black helmets right here, and this is a step in the right direction. They're changing something, and I love these helmets off first glance, let me tell ya. Y'all did your thing with this. This helmet right here is supposed to go with our alternate and our color rush uniforms, and I can just picture it now, and I'm in love. And honestly, just looking at them, it just makes me wanna. Hey yo, what the fuck? All right, you know what? Let's keep things PG. We just know these are some sexy helmets. And the Cardinals also released this graphic right here, going in full depth of what they did on this helmet. And obviously we see the two visual changes, like our helmet used to be white with a gray face mask, and now it's just all black. Already a massive dub if you ask me. And then you look at the first thing they did, and they added a shiny gloss red sparkle on it. And when you just take a look at it, you can't really see that, but looking at it up close, it looks so sick. And instead of a normal decal, they made a chrome decal, and you can see the shine on that, that just looks sick. Already two major dubs, and then we already talked about the black face mask, but they also made the clips black as well. And then you see in the bottom right the dates we're going to be rocking this. August 21st, I believe, is a preseason game against the Baltimore Ravens, so that's going to be our debut with this helmet. And then two games later down the road, October 9th against the Philadelphia Eagles and October 20th against the New Orleans Saints. And like we mentioned earlier, these are going to be worn with our alternate uniforms and our color rush jerseys, which makes sense because they're black jerseys. Thanks, Captain Obvious. And if you guys haven't seen this video yet, here's the unveiling video the Cardinals media team released earlier today, and it basically just showcased them showing off the helmet and showing it to some of our players. To complement our alternate and color rush uniform, we're introducing a new alternate helmet this season. Hit it. Wow. That's nice. Can I touch it? Oh, that's awesome. With a galactic black fire sky shell. Nice. The absence of color explodes with infinite red granite flecks, mined from the depths of the Sonoran Desert. Holy So you know it's good. Excuse my language. A midnight black face mask means dark intentions. Logo's cool, got a little depth to it. And the shadowy three-dimensional accents to the iridescent cardinal insignia puts the go in logo. Part science, science, part work of art, art, and guaranteed to turn heads. Yeah. The alternate helmet does not replace the traditional white helmet and will be used for one week of practice in three games. Not responsible for helmet empty symptoms. Should helmet empty symptoms develop, please see your nearest fantasy football commissioner for unprofessional football advice. Football helmet should only be used for protection and not while cooking, driving, for any household construction projects. It's got like the little glitter in it. Yeah, yeah. So overall, this is a pretty freaking sick helmet. The Cardinals definitely did their thing with this, and this also gives me a ton of optimism about what our future potential new jerseys could look like. You know, if they want to unveil those, ahem, <clears throat> take a hint. Nah, I don't really feel like it. And also, if you guys want to see a video of me reacting to brand new jerseys and jersey concepts that people have made for the Arizona Cardinals, let me know down in the comment section below. I've seen some pretty fire ones and I would love to make that video, but I want to see if that's something y'all want to see as well. If you do, spam it in the comment section. But with that being said, that's pretty much going to wrap up today's video. Also, let me know how you guys are feeling about these helmets. I love them, but I want to gauge your guys' opinions as well. And also, if you guys are new to the channel and ended up enjoying today's video, consider hitting that subscribe button. I post NFL-related content, and I also post NBA-related content on my second channel. If you guys want, you can check that out at Mythic Hoops as well. I'm going to be posting over there a ton as long as my immune system lets me, so go check me out. But like I said, that's all I got for today's video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. It's been your boy Mythic. Peace out.